What's up, MP? What's up, Danny? Hey, you gonna take it easy on me after the night, right? I don't know about all that. Come on, bro. I had your poster on my wall growing up and everything. You trying to be my welcome to the league moment now? Yeah. I'm just gonna do what I do. Ah, Looking forward to seeing what you got, though. <laughs> I right, bet. So. And here in the Eastern quarterfinals of the in-season tournament, we begin the knockout round. It's win or go home. Well, at least as far as this tournament is concerned, it is. And with both of these teams emerging victorious from their groups in the previous round, the motivation is there to continue their strong play. A look at the opening lineup for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Mobley and Allen, the combo out front. Garland runs point with Mitchell at the two. And it's Okoro in at the three. Now here's Mitchell. Playing Detroit, he was nearly unstoppable. Six on the shot clock. Mobley, a screen on Levine. The three from Mitchell. DeRozan with the rebound. Here are the Bulls with the ball. It's a three-point game. Got it from about 16 feet. That's all muscle memory for DeRozan. He's the king of the mid-range. Here in the first, a little over a minute played so far. It's hauled in by the Bulls. And this matchup with the Cavaliers, it's their first meeting of the season. Clutch passes to Green. And it's hammered home by Green. Sky high, one of his advantages as a undersized four. And so it's Garland who brings up the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Pass to Mitchell. Just over a minute and a half played here in this one. Here's Mobley. Green covering. The steal! Out left to the wing. Here's Clutch. Good. And it's DeRozan who picks up the assist. And what's working here? Each guy is willing to make the next pass. And the Cavaliers call time here. There's no way Coach likes this effort level. They need to refocus. It's so easy to get run over when you lose even a little edge. Look for them to come out much more aggressive. And the first quarter of action, two minutes in. On the wing, Mitchell. He's covered by Levine. Allen with a screen on Levine. Mitchell, the pass to Allen. Oh, and again, unable to change momentum here. And Grant, a positive for the Bulls over the last few seasons. They work hard to get good shots. Well, B.A., that's definitely part of their DNA. They've had the personnel to do it, and guys who are disciplined and patient. Here's Clutch. So versatile on offense. Averaging around 23 and a half points per contest. And it's Green missing. After five shots, that's their first miss. I definitely call that a good start. Clutch passes to Green. Rejected by Allen. What a difference maker defensively. Allen just controlling the airspace. Mitchell finds Garland. Mobley outside. To the paint. Here's Mitchell. He's now one for two with that bucket. Finally, a make for this team. Hopefully it gives them a little confidence. For whatever reason, they came in a little tight tonight. That should loosen them up. Here's Clutch. Jams it in off a great move. What a way to begin this game. Dominating at both ends of the floor. They came in prepared focus and really jumped on the other team early and it's the Cavaliers with the ball after the basket by Chicago 
The three from Mitchell. The rebound by Clutch. Just a little off to start this game. One for five, looking to find some kind of rhythm. Levine against Mitchell. And Levine gets it to go on the assist by Vucevic. And early on, they've been on a tear. Just getting whatever they want offensively. They established the pace. They made shots. This is why they're way out in front. Mobley. And Mobley throws it down. And you pay so much attention to Garland, and that allows teammates to get involved. Vucevic, a screen on Garland. Here's Clutch. The Cavaliers pull it in. They defeated Detroit in their last game. Oh, my. Talk about mental toughness. The crowd was roaring against them, but they were able to focus and finish the task at hand. It was a terrific performance we got a chance to watch. They got into a nice rhythm and made smart adjustments along the way. Here's Clutch. The Cavs getting their last shot to go. Pass to Green. DeRozan outside. Picked by Vucevic. Five on the clock. DeRozan passes to Levine. Off target from three-point range. Just enough of a shot contest to bother him. Now here's Garland. He's covered closely. The three. Knocks down the triple. Garland's got five. Anyone who questions Garland's deep range, run that film right back. Here's Clutch, guarded by Garland. And Clutch gets it to go. <laughs> and their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. And so it's Garland who brings up the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers. They trail by seven. And he drives in, 14 feet away. Here's Allen. Rebounded by Green. Woo, blown opportunity right there. Won't get many chances easier than that one. Levine can't hit. It's been a rough quarter for him. Can't seem to find any kind of rhythm. Garland scanning the floor. A step back shot. The three from Okoro. And the Cavaliers, another three. And that's what they want to do. Get him open looks early. Here's Clutch, guarded by Garland. Pass to Vucevic. Here's Clutch. The three is up. No, he's made three, missed two now. And he almost made them regret defending him so loosely. And Grant, you watch Darius Garland. It often looks like he's a step ahead out there. He's got a great natural feel for the game, B.A. I mean, on the ball, he makes quick reads, and he'll create for himself and others. Off the ball, he always seems to be in the right spot and ready to fire. Can you say immediate entry into the highlight reel? Ooh, what a dunk, B.A. <laughs> It's showtime now, man. They've built up a lead, and they're starting to rub it in. For Cleveland, they've gone 5 of 12 in this first quarter. Inside. And the shot is good by Garland. Garland's got his third basket on the night right there. In this period, they're feeding him, and he's feeling it. Clutch passes to Vucevic. Outside Levine. The three. Knocks it down from distance. Levine's got a second bucket of the night. Now a volume three-point shooter. Zach Levine knows how effective he can be outside the arc. Garland for three. And the Cavaliers, another three. This defense just can't stay connected to shooters. Chicago leading. Here's Clutch. Really played well against New Orleans in his last game. Oh, his shooting remains on point. Three for four thus far. And their offensive game plan is clear. Get it inside and go to work. Outside Garland. Outside Mitchell. Let's it go from deep. And it's Chicago with the board. Green's got his fourth rebound in this one. Pass to Levine. Green against Mobley. Right side green. Here's Clutch. Takes the three. And that 
comes off the assist by Green. And now a nine-point Bulls lead. And taking a look at this first half, they've just shown better shot selection. What they have done is ran their plays all the way through until they get something they like. It's good. Garland's got 12. They're still behind, but not because of his efforts. He's been unbelievable this quarter. Vucevic, a screen on Garland. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. The defense there doing whatever they can to protect the rim. And a chance for a moment to check out the scoring breakdown for the Bulls. They came out firing from deep. It's always good for a team's confidence when you can start a game that hot. Another thing they're doing well early on is moving the ball, playing selfless basketball, and getting everybody involved on the offensive end. If you're the defense, not much you can do. Donovan Mitchell had his mind made up. Bad intentions. Craig with a screen. Clutch passes to Craig. DeRozan with the ball. Niang's there, and it's DeRozan missing. Cleveland has gone three of six shooting from beyond the arc. Pass to Mitchell. Now here's Struess, defended by DeRozan. Now here's LeBert. Just four to shoot. Niang with it. Now Mitchell. He's guarded by Caruso. And it's Mitchell. The miss. Hard to create space in that mid-range area. He would have been better passing that off. And the basket by DeRozan. DeRozan's gotten his second bucket. The defense can't let DeRozan get this deep inside or else they're cooked. And Mitchell launches it from deep. He got it up in time, but it would not fall for him. And so it's Chicago. They have a nice nine-point cushion at the end of the quarter. Getting lots of great looks. Shooting it well. That's why they're up. We'll be right back. So far through one quarter, it's been a lopsided game. We'll see if that changes here in the second. And guys, what's your take on the Bulls so far? Well, they've used the fast break well to score easy points and keep the defense unsettled. You know this, the team that dictates the pace typically rules the roost. We see that here early on. All right, on the floor for Cleveland, getting going in the second. We've got Donovan Mitchell, George Niang out there with Max Truce. Then it's Karis LeVert, and it's Morris in at the five spot. The Cavs trailing. And what you love about the Cavs, on most nights, they take really good shots, Grant. Uh, they do, B.A. I mean, I love the way they work the ball into the painted area. And even their guards are constantly penetrating, getting into the paint, creating for themselves and their teammates. And here's Caruso outside. And again, it's the Bulls from deep. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. A moment to hear from Allie LaForce. Hey, Brian. Donovan Mitchell is a man of the people. He said, quote, just being in the community, whether it's going to high school games or barbecues, you never know what that one moment will do for a child. I'm forever grateful that I'm able to do that and get that reaction, and I will continue to do that throughout my life. Guys? Yeah, terrific stuff there, Allie. Thanks for that. And he makes a first. Well, Grant, there's one thing Mitchell will always be remembered for by Cavs fans. Oh, so true, B.A. I mean, 71 points in a game in the 2022-23 season, setting a Cleveland franchise record. And for a franchise... <laughs> Look for Cleveland. 
Allen comes in for Thompson, and Coro is subbed in for Struess. Let's have a look at the early favorites to compete in this year's three-point contest. Many of the top shooters in the league. Most of these guys are going to collect a ton of votes, and if this is who makes the final cut, then it's going to be a year to remember. Well, you look at Levine, he's going to need to move up this list big time to be part of the three-point contest, but he's got a shot. Maybe, especially if he can get hot from beyond the arc, and he certainly has the ability to do so. And this year's contest is really shaping up to be one to remember. Plenty of dead-eye shooters on that list so far. And lots of guys have a three-point shot now, but this list is really the cream of the crop when it comes to putting up long-range bombs. And Grant, with this game being the quarterfinals matchup in the NBA Cup, it'll be interesting to see just how much these teams are willing to lay it on the line. Yeah, some teams didn't make any changes during group play, but that mentality can change in a heartbeat when you know this could be the end of the road if you drop the game tonight. And it's the Cavaliers with the ball. 11-point game. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's a shot he typically makes. Vucevic, a screen on Mitchell. Clutch passes to Vucevic. The open shot, DeRozan. Money on the 19-footer. DeRozan's got 10 points. And just executing at a high level. I mean, taking what the defense allows and putting in the work. The reason why they stayed aggressive and they have not let up this entire night. And at this point, I wouldn't expect them to. Levert finds Mitchell. Yes, sir! Donovan Mitchell from Mitchell. long range! For three. Love the assertiveness from Donovan Mitchell. It's what makes him such a deadly scorer. DeRozan, a screen on Mitchell. Oh, rejected by Allen. They recover it. Caruso misses. The Cavaliers have gone just 5 of 12 here in the second quarter. Here's Okoro. He's guarded by White. Here's Niang. The three-pointer off the mark. For Chicago, they've gone 6 of 11 here in the second quarter. And the dunk by DeRozan. Alex Caruso, he can make that pass in his sleep. Cleveland has gone just 1 of 5 so far this quarter from 3. From deep, Mitchell. DeMar DeRozan grabs the miss. And this is exactly who you want taking that shot. He just missed it. Here's Clutch, defended by the edge. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. Now here's Mitchell. He's got 13. And once again, off the mark by Cleveland. Missing that one helps out all the analytical guys from the mid-range. Timeout called here. Chicago decides to talk it over. They're fresh off the win against the Pelicans. <laughs> and in that game, they owned the glass. Most of the second chance opportunities went to them. They were able to convert a lot of those offensive rebounds. That's the key, generating points off those extra possessions. Green's checked in for Chicago. Levine comes in for White. Evan Mobley, he's checked in for Cleveland. Garland comes in for Levert. Basket's good. Clutch has got 19 points. They're really dictating the tempo on both ends of the court. You love it. This has been an impressive performance tonight. Even with a big lead, they've maintained their focus. Nice rebound. Trying to match the other team's intensity right now. He buries it from three. Clutch has got eight points in the quarter. And staying with it. He drained two triples in the first quarter. Now gets this one. Trying to find a spark here. Yes, indeed. A rough stretch offensively. They could really use a basket. Mobley, left side. Pass to Garland to end the run. Buckets. He's now 6 of 10 from the field. And this team's struggles are not his fault. He's putting in work at the offensive end. Vucevic, a screen on Garland. It's stolen by Garland. And pushing it up, here's Cleveland. Let's it go from 11. And the ball out of play.
play, the Bulls will have it. And now that we're into December, let's check in on the Rookie of the Year race. And this year's rookie class has been an exceptionally fun one to watch. So I'm sure fans want to know who's out in front. What an incredible start to his rookie season. Sitting in the number one spot right now, but I'm sure this will be an exciting rookie race. And you know his confidence must be soaring, sitting at the top of this impressive list of young talent. Even though this season's just getting started, it's a big accomplishment, a testament to his relative maturity. Allen against Vucevic. And Vucevic slams it in. Great positioning by Vucevic. Hustle points for the big man. And for the Cavaliers, they're shooting 35% in the second so far. Allen a screen. Levert passes to Allen. Second chance shot. And he takes it up and lays it in. Allen's got his first points of the game. At the end of the day, when the ball goes up, there's no substitute for effort. Vucevic, a screen on Garland. Clutch passes to Vucevic. The kick out to White. For three, and it's good. Credit Levine with the assist. Levine's got three assists tonight. Now here's Garland. The D's right on him. Allen against Vucevic. Outside Garland. Here's Allen. That one is off. Nice D from Vucevic. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they've rebounded the ball tremendously well. Pass to Clutch. Back to Vucevic. Outside for Levine. Sinks the tray. Levine's got his third bucket of the night. Back-to-back -back threes. Making their defense work on the perimeter a bit. Here's Levert. His offense has been solid. Scoring around 11 and a half points a game. Now Allen. Back to Levert. Good setup. Led him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Levert's got four points now in the quarter. Here's Clutch. He's got 22. White on the wing. Pass to Clutch. Six to shoot. And again! Chicago with a three. They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Oh, there's the alley. Levine with a steal. And the rebound goes to the Cavaliers. Okoro passes to Levert. There's 47 seconds left to play in the first half. Garland for three. And it's cleared by Vucevic. Vucevic has got six rebounds here tonight. Clutch passes to Levine. And the foul called on Evan Mobley. That's his first foul. First personal foul. Third team foul. Pointer Vucevic and that one's good and Green with the assist Vucevic has gotten a second bucket on the night and so it's Garland who brings up the ball for the Cleveland Cavaliers and Garland gets doubled Okoro on the wing currently averaging five points a game Mobley finds the bird just five to shoot Garland for three Drains the triple. Garland's got 18 points in the game. Matching the triple from the other end. Garland is game. On the wing, Levine. Three-pointer. That misses. Would have counted had it gone. A dominating first half of play. And so far, it hasn't been close. Bulls out in front, running away with this one. And time now for the halftime break with the third quarter soon to follow on 2K Sports. Put your hands together for your arena 
Welcome, everybody. Let's get right to it. It's been nothing short of a tremendous challenge for the Cleveland Cavaliers. Hey, guys, does it does it feel like it's warm in the studio to you? I'm always warm. I run hot. It's probably because of your shack brightness. Says the man who hurts so bad he walks like a duck. I don't talk like a duck. Quack, 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 quack. And looking at the first half we just watched, wow, what a performance for the Bulls. They've been the better passing team tonight, by far. Everyone's looking engaged, involved. They have great chemistry out there. Yeah, you can see these guys enjoying playing together. That makes everything easier. Practice, traveling, all of it. That does it for halftime. Let's get back to game action. Here's Brian Anderson with the start of the third quarter. Yeah, there wasn't too much drama in the first half, but maybe things will tighten up here in the second. And Cleveland's shooting about 43% on this one. On the wings, it's the dynamite pair of Levine and DeRozan. Nikola Vucevic is out there with Green. And it's Clutch in a point guard. That's the five out there for the Bulls. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Green in the post. He's against Allen. Green with a screen on Mobley. Down to five on the shot clock. Clutch. Cavaliers pull it in. Allen's got a rebound number eight here already in the game. Back to Garland. Mobley outside. Pass to Allen. Out to Garland. Launches it. It's hauled in by the Bulls. DeRozan's got a rebound number five here tonight. Well, some have called DeMar DeRozan a master of the mid-range, Smitty. Maybe rightly so. B.A.I. definitely give him that title. Few guys are as efficient in that area as him. In fact, most avoid it. Cleveland has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the third. Mobley on a screen. Mitchell, the pass to Mobley. That one goes in. What a feed by Donovan Mitchell taking full advantage of the weakness in the defense. And for the Bulls, they're shooting an efficient 64%. Excellent. Clutch passes to Vucevic. Here's Clutch. The three ball. Fires the three. The rebound by Allen. Allen's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Back to Okoro. Mobley, right side. Fires from deep. On target from range. Mobley's gotten his third basket of the night. Aside from the rim runners in this league, most bigs are now asked to help stretch the floor. Here's DeRozan. It's rebounded by Cleveland. Shaky start to the half. Going one for four. Still trying to find that groove. Allen finds Garland. Here's Okoro. Back to Mitchell. From deep three-point land. And it's cleared by Vucevic. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Proud. Outside Mitchell. And he lobs it up top. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. Levine against Garland. Green, a screen. Here's Clutch. Pass to Green. Outside for Levine. And here is Vucevic. Allen defending. Fades and shoots. And the basket is good. Vucevic has got seven points. And this team encourages Vuce to look for his shot because they recognize how lethal he can be. Here's Garland with the drive. Basket counts. Strong performance from him but he may need to do even more if they're going to win this game. Here's Clutch. 27 points for him. And it's Green missing. 
A little under three and a half minutes off the clock now in the third quarter. Mitchell, the pass to Allen. Out to the right wing. Here's Garland. Oh, he's looking good tonight. He's drilled 9 of 15 so far. Slithery inside. Garland has that short area of quickness. Here's Clutch. Guarded by Garland. Yes, it's good. Clutch has got four points in the quarter. He's given a great lift to this offense tonight. Very, very efficient. Garland, the pass to Mitchell. Back to Allen. Pass to Akuro. Garland with the ball. The three is up. And it's cleared by Vucevic. Vucevic has got his eighth rebound here tonight. Here's Clutch. Guarded by Garland. Picked by Vucevic. Clutch passes to Vucevic. Takes the assist and lays it in. Nice setup. He's got nine. When operating in the pick and roll, Vooch knows how to use angles to free himself up. Allen on the wing. Wide open. Rebound by the Bulls. His struggle is real. He's been way off with his shot all evening long. Vucevic, a screen on Garland. Kicks it to DeRozan. Over Okoro. The rebound by Garland. The Cavaliers have gotten only four of ten shots to fall so far in the third. Well, the last few years, defense has been the calling card for the Cavaliers. Yeah, a lot of that has to do with their big men. Not only do they have the length and size, they've got tremendous agility and are able to switch on to the perimeter as well. Cleveland needs to get off a shot. Three-pointer off the mark. Phenomenal how many threes he drained in the first half, especially considering he's hit none since. A chance here to catch up with Allie from the sideline. Hey, B.A., well, the Cavaliers are one of the best young teams in the league, and it's up to their point guard, Darius Garland, to help distribute. He said, quote, we have so much talent on the floor. I just try to get my big fellows the ball so they can stay active and work for us on the defensive end as well. That's the game within the game right there, Brian. Yeah, he's got the right idea. Good stuff, Allie. Thank you. Pass to Levine. Now Green. Green with a screen on Garland. Here's Clutch. And here is Vucevic. Here's DeRozan. That's in there. Vucevic with the assist. Vucevic has got four assists in the game. Strong pass there to set up the basket. And it's Garland with the ball for Cleveland. They'll take on the Magic at Amway Center after this one. That'll put them right in the middle of a five-game road trip. Outside Mitchell. Back to Garland. Garland draws the double. Mobley outside. Pass to Allen. Back to Mobley. To win the cold spell. DeMar DeRozan grabs a miss. For Chicago, they've gotten six of 11 attempts to fall so far in the third. Here's Clutch. That's 29 for him. Down low. Vucevic in the post. Ooh, coming through again. Shooting five for seven now. <laughs> They're really working the paint now. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. And the Cavaliers call time here. Chicago making some changes. Craig is checked in for Green. And it's White in for DeMar DeRozan. Here's Levert. Garland, the pass to Nier. Jacks up a three. Rebound by the Bulls. Vucevic has got 11 rebounds in the game. And their physical dominance has been on display. A 10 rebound advantage is a good indicator of how this game has gone. To the inside. They swipe it. And pushing it up. Here's Cleveland. Here's Garland. Oh, not wasting any time and taking the shot and hitting it. Garland's got 24 points. And you see Garland out there running, hustling to make a play. Here's Clutch, guarded by Garland. Craig passes to Clutch. White on the wing. He's checked by Levert. Four on the clock. Craig with a screen on Levert. White can't hit. Woo, that's just a case of bad defense and even worse offense. 
Two minutes remaining. The outside. Two minutes. The three from Okoro. It's hauled in by the Bulls. Here's Clutch. And he makes no mistake. Slam dunk. Putting consistent pressure on this defense. Just the threat of him out there makes this offense work. Garland for three. That shot, no good. Here are the Bulls with the ball. They're on a 14-6 run. Picked by Vucevic. And there's the lob. And he lays in the alley-oop pass. Just a perfect pass. And some pretty slick body control on the finish, too. Man, that's butter. And Cleveland's shooting a low 29% since halftime. Here's Garland. Blocked! And it's out of bounds to Cleveland. And that shot was going nowhere thanks to that aggressive swat. Oh, amazing indeed. And getting stops like that only encourages them to keep attacking on the offensive end. Both teams deciding to change it up. have lamented the quote-unquote protected guys. Every bump, they go to the free throw line. Does that bother you, Smitty? Yeah, it would have bothered me more if I had to guard them. The league has made it clear they want the rules evenly applied. Star treatment should not extend to the officiating. Outside Struess. Pass to Mitchell. This one for three. Chicago grabs the miss. White's got five rebounds tonight. They've shown the power inside. Their rebounding effort has been sensational. A chance to get a quick injury report. Let's find out the news on Darius Garland. Allie, what's the update? Guys, I had a moment to catch up with the Cavaliers head athletic trainer. A bruised hip is the diagnosis. So while there's a lot of pain, presumably no significant damage. It is a major loss right in the thick of the season. Other guys will have to step up. Let's see who answers the call. All right, Allie, good stuff there. Always on top of it. Yeah, I mean, it's just crazy. Even with the advancements in strength training, injuries continue to impact the game. And we're seeing that across all sports. Guys are just getting bigger, faster. The human body can take only so much. On the court for the Cavaliers. Donovan Mitchell out there with Karis LeVert. Then it's Max Struess. Then there's Okoro. And it's Niang in at the five down low. Knocking them down again and again. Donovan Mitchell is just going off. Here's Clutch. And again, Chicago, no good. Cleveland has gone two of six so far in the fourth. Pass to Mitchell. 4-3. It's another three for Cleveland. Sending shockwaves now. That's his third triple of this half. Fourth of the game. Caruso, a screen on Mitchell. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. That one on Mitchell. And a moment here to take a look at the scoring breakdown for the Bulls. I think they've looked to dump it down low as often as possible. And so far, they've been super successful using this attack. We also got to highlight how on fire they've been from three-point land. They've continued to capitalize from beyond the arc in this one. Outside White. On the wing, Caruso. Pass to Desumu. And it's been a pretty amazing trend, Steve. Five straight years, the MVP has gone to guys 6'11 and up. So much for small ball taking over. I love it. The big guy is back in play, and it should be. We have some guards that are extremely talented, but these bigs are playing big, and they have skills like a small guy. Now here's Struess. The egg outside. And the Cavaliers, another three. The defense is nowhere to be found guarding the three-point shot. The Bulls have gotten five of 12 shot attempts to go so far in the fourth quarter. Here's Clutch. Check by Mitchell. Clutch passes to White. Clock at six. Clutch. And they come right back with their own three-pointer. Clutch has got 35. This has been a running theme for him. Hit a number of threes in the first half. Now nails another. 
drew the contact from long and coach doesn't like the call at all he's opting to use his challenge he wants the officials to look at the replay And even with the coach's challenge in place, we've seen so many of these personal foul calls still disputed. The previous play is under review. Gray area in a lot of these calls. But at least we have the option to take a second look so the officials can be sure they get it right. The ruling on the floor stands. And they've made their decision. The call will stand. And as much as it hurts to lose a challenge, I think Coach would challenge that call again if he could. He really disagreed with the foul, and he's still weaved. Jared Allen, he's checked in for Cleveland. Darius Garland comes in for Struess. Will Steve, the most recent CBA, increase two-way player slots. Now teams can carry three instead of two. How do you like it? I love it. The two-way player rule has been a huge success. Lots of guys have been discovered that way, given a chance to play in this league. Craig with a screen on Garland. Clutch passes to Craig. Ooh, stolen by Allen. To the middle. Here's Okoro. And the basket's good. Off the assist from Garland. Garland's got his third assist of the night. Hey, they're just getting pushed around inside. With the step back. Clutch passes to Caruso. Here's Desumu. He's checked by Levert. Allen brings a double team. Inside, Craig. And the shot goes down. And I respect the strategy. Despite the sizable lead, you got to stay in attack mode. You want to stay aggressive. Right at the rim. Driving another nail into the coffin. Count that one. The assist. Darius Garland. Chicago has gone four of eight from three-point land during the fourth. Here's Clutch. Pass to Craig. Here's to Sumu. Craig with a screen on the vert. 19-footer. And the basket by Desumu. Desumu's got six points in the quarter. You got to appreciate the consistency. Night in and night out, he brings it. Mitchell against White. Throws it up high. And Mitchell with the slam. You've got to trust your receiver to go get that pass. Did you see Donovan Mitchell catch and finish in the same motion? Craig with a screen on Garland. Clutch passes to Craig. Out of bounds. It'll go to the Cavaliers. And a quick look at how the Chicago Bulls schedule is shaping up. On Monday, they'll be taking on Chris Middleton and the Milwaukee Bucks. Then on Tuesday, they'll be taking on Nikola Jokic and the Denver Nuggets. The road is never the highlight of your schedule for any team. But for these guys, it is a chance to go out there, test themselves, and see how well they gel outside of home court. It could be a very valuable experience. The Cavaliers making a switch here. Mobley's checked in. And Garland gets doubled. The three from Okoro. And Craig pulls it down. Craig's got six rebounds here tonight. Here's Clutch. Craig with a screen on Garland. And he's going for the oop here. Nice job. Those passes have to be right on the money around the painted area. Craig's gone three for three from the floor. There's the triple. And it's Desumu with a rebound. He continues to let it fly, but the makes have been few and far between. Here's Clutch, guarded by Garland. Oh, and Mobley with the block. Fast break, Cleveland. Here's Okoro. And the basket's good, off the assist from Garland. What a fantastic pass from Garland. This is why his guys really enjoy playing with him. Two minutes remaining in the game. Here's Clutch, guarded by Garland. Clutch passes to White. Here's Clutch. Garland comes with the double team. Desumu on the wing from deep. And again, it's Chicago 
with a three. And he's not taking it easy on them at all. I mean, we all know he's going to keep pouring it on. I mean, defensively, if you have any hope of coming back in this game, you can't afford to give him those looks. Ooh, the defense gets away with a late rotation. That's a shot he normally makes. Clutch's shot is off. And that's out of bounds. Last touch by White. And what a complete performance we saw from them. A dominant win in every way for the Bulls. And everything seemed to go their way today. They were firing on all cylinders, Grant. Yeah, B.A., this was the kind of performance you relish as a player. Just a very impressive win. And they add to the win column their 19th victory this year. And what a huge performance it was for Clutch. You have to appreciate the unselfishness. He kept the ball moving, kept everyone involved. Really enjoyable to watch. Defense dodged a bullet that time. Total breakdown. Mitchell finds Allen. And here's Mitchell. It's picked off. Here's Clutch. That one no good. 41 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Okoro on the wing. Sinks it from distance. Woo, he got a clean look, and he makes the defense pay for disrespecting him. And it's ball off the drive. And Clutch gets it to go. Clutch has got 38 points. Impressive job by this team. And you really can't discount the impact of this crowd here. They gave the team tremendous energy tonight. The fans were fantastic. It was a true home court advantage. Pass to Mitchell. Puts up a three. And the Cavaliers, another three. three and that was a little payback for what happened on the other end. Mitchell showing the range. Steps back. Here's Clutch. It's off. So it's the Bulls winning this one easily. And Grant, their cup run continues. Off they go to the semifinals. the chance to represent the East in the Cup Championship. What an opportunity for this team. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Allie LaForce, Grant Hill, and Steve Smith, this is Brian Anderson with our 2K Sports crew signing off. We'll see you next time. Good game, man. Hey, good game, bro. Looking forward to that next one, though. Yeah, you trying to meet with that Dining Revenge game, huh? I mean, yeah, I need a little payback. All right, that's what's up. Yes, sir. I'll be seeing you. Yes, sir. We'll be ready.